West Lafayette, Indiana, on the campus of Purdue University, where this crowd is all fired up for this college football encounter. And now let's head down to the coin toss. It's brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. Purdue is lined up to kick the ball off first, and we are ready to go. It's fielded at the two. He's taken down at the 30-yard line. Wisconsin's coaching staff so confident they know they've got a guy that's one of the best running backs in the country and that they can just play their game and not worry about the fact they're on the road. Well, Brett, his big playability not only can give you big chunks of yards on the road, but more importantly, it can quiet this atmosphere and allow the quarterback in this offense to just getting back and, and just being able to run and be able to communicate. And I think that's a big challenge for this team. So look for his big playability to maybe even out the atmosphere and give this offense a chance to be able to execute. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. He's got it with room to run. Steps out of bounds at the 45. Allen picks up around five yards with that catch. And that's just great execution on that short pass play. And the quarterback didn't waste any time getting rid of that one. He took the snap and he threw it right out there. Makes the catch and he's got nowhere to go. From their own 47 yard line, second down. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That's good for a game of five yards. That'll bring up third and two. Now he tries to buy some time. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. You have to keep an eye on this guy, especially during passing situations, because he does a great job of getting to the quarterback, as we saw right there. Sheffield is back deep to return. <laughs> Tries to get around the corner. He makes it to the 28-yard line. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. It's second down, seven to go. Ball on their own 32. He fights forward to about the 33. Gain of one yard. That'll make it 35. Caught with room to work. Knocked out of bounds at the 40-yard line. Brad, you can really feel and sense the energy coming from the sidelines right now. They know how important it is to pick up first downs. And the coaches right now are showing the excitement that they have and yelling out the next play for the offense. But clearly, the offense coordinator very happy about the execution on that last play. From their own 40-yard line, second down. Nice run, and he's brought down. Third down. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Throws complete, and he stopped immediately. He made the catch, but he didn't get the first down. Yeah, right now, the way this defense is swarming, there's just no room for him to get upfield for the first down. So they're going to go for it here. A short yardage defense here. 
Nice run there as they work the outside. And this play is number eight on the drive. He tackles him for a loss. That'll bring up second and 12. So it's second and 12. Ball on the 45 yard line. Setting up play action. Looking for the corner. He takes off. Tackle made right around the 24-yard line. This one might be coming back, folks. So let's check out the penalty. That penalty will move him back a bit. Yeah, with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. From the 45-yard line, it's second down. He scrambles, and they bring him down for a sack on the play. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 33. for the tight end, but they can't hook up. Try to change the field position with this kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Nice run up the middle. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Fires out to his receiver. Tackle around the 36-yard line. I'll tell you something. I'm loving this quarterback's confidence more and more as this game goes on. He's really throwing the ball with some purpose. Gets to about the 37-yard line. From their own 37-yard line. Second down. And they make the stop at the 40. Nice run there. So the tailback's going to come away with a first down on the play. This young man ran with some purpose there and picked up six yards. From their own 46-yard line, it's first down. They'll bring him down at the 42. the 41-yard line. And once again, they'll come to the line, try to convert on third down. He 
He steps out around the 45 yard line. They've got 10 guys up. They're coming after the kick. He's got the corner. He takes it at the 12. Gets to about the 27 yard line. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. Good open field tackle. But if this defense keeps taking chances with these blitzes, sure, they may get to the quarterback once in a while, but they also are giving up some big plays like that one right there. First and 10, ball on the 37-yard line. Throws it on the run. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. Hey, this guy's got to forget about the drop. Remember, he was in good position to make a play. And he hits him hard at the 37. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. With the defensive line neutralizing the blocks, these linebackers are able to come up and make plays in the holes. Third down and 11 coming up here. Ball on their own 37. He's in trouble. And he's taken down right around the 40. That's good for being three yards. That makes it fourth and eight. They're stacking the line. It looks like they're coming after this punt. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. Got to wonder right now which offense is going to open this thing up a little bit. I think the answer will be which offensive coordinator is willing to take a chance or two to try to open some plays up. Because right now, not only are they losing the battle up front, but they're really not testing the defense downfield at all. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. Strike to his receiver, no good. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. That's a D of six on the play. That'll bring up third and four. Tackled right away. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 41. Makes it out to about the 50. That's a D. That brings up second and nine. after a decent run up the gut. Gain of six on the play. First down. So at the end of one quarter, this one's scoreless. Set to resume action here in the second quarter, and we've got a tight ball game. Throws incomplete. From the 44-yard line, it's second down. They'll drop him for a loss. And the defense just swarmed over him on that one. Yeah, they were able to penetrate the offensive line and get to the running back before that play even had a chance. 
Here's the eighth play of the series. There's a strike complete, and he's tackled around the 42-yard line. He doesn't want to touch back here. He wants to knock this ball inside the 10. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. They've been like a couple of fighters feeling each other out so far. Let's see if they start to open it up a little bit more now. Quick pass tight end, and he wasn't ready for it. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 20. And down he goes, right around the 22-yard line. Throws complete, and he's hammered. The defense looks like they're going to send in the cavalry on this one. Not great, but not bad either. As long as your main priorities are not turning the ball over and establishing solid field position, then you're headed in the right direction. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum, so as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Quick throw out to the receiver. He's tackled at the 46. First down. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 46-yard line. Fires it out. He's taken down at about the 41. That screen pass nets maybe five yards. That brings him second and five. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. From the 41-yard line, it's third down. Makes it out to maybe the 40-yard line. made around the 33 yard line that play could not have come at a better time oh, that was absolutely the perfect time to go with that play on fourth down from the 33 yard line first down Pitch right and taken down for a loss. Well, give the defense all the credit here. They had that one snuffed out from the start. It could have been an even bigger loss. Gets to about the 34-yard line. Third down, and they need to get it to the 23. Gets it out to him again. He gets hit out of bounds. Right around the 26-yard line. Wisconsin is looking to go up by three. He gets it up, and it's long enough. 
And he nails the long field goal. And he's got to be happy about that kick. Oh, no question. This kid is just a solid kicker. 3 nothing, Wisconsin. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. Tackle made at the 25. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Runs outside for a nice game. It's second and seven. Ball on their own 29. Gets it on the pitch. And he makes it out to about the 31 yard line. Gain of two on the play. That'll bring up 34. And he shoved out of bounds right around the 34. The defense has everybody on the line. I think they're going to come after this one. And he's tackled at the 35. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Wisconsin is up a field goal. Laterals back. He gets out to about the 35-yard line. From their own 35-yard line, second down. Caught open field. Knocked out of bounds at the 49. Superb effort by the receiver to come down with that ball. Well, this comes down to the timing between the quarterback and the receiver, and the result, again, a nice play for the offense. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 49. Play action here. He's going to scramble. There he goes. Tackle at the 36-yard line. And that was a nice pickup by the quarterback. Brad, I think this guy is amazing. He has an uncanny ability to scramble, and it showed right there on that play. From the 36-yard line, first down. And he is drilled at the 35-yard line. That's good for a gain of one yard. That brings us second and nine. Time right, time right. Pull down, pull down. Mike eight. Mike eight. Quick out to his receiver. And they make the stop at the 28. Gain of seven yards. That'll bring up third and two. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. Wisconsin is up by three. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry, and he's hit immediately. That makes it first and ten. He makes it out to maybe the 16-yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. He gets out to about the 15-yard line. So we're looking at another third down here.
tipped away. Brett, I noticed during practice this week that this linebacker may be a wide receiver or running back at heart. He's messing around during practice with some of the offensive skill players. Really, it pays off for him here as he's able to show enough instincts there to be able to knock that ball away. The kick is up, and he's got it. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. He's to the 20. Makes it to the 22-yard line. You know, we're getting so used to pinball football with a lot of points. Kind of fun to see defenses play this well. Kind of refreshing, isn't it? I mean, every single week we call games, and you're seeing scores in the 30s and 40s. This is one of those low-scoring games. Which offense will get that big break? Eventually, it could be the team that wins it. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Looking for his man, incomplete. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. Nothing doing on the halfback draw. So the Badgers taking their first time out of the half. Steps out of bounds at the 27. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. He's to the 40. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. This offense is just going to be kicking themselves. They're moving the ball very well. In fact, they're getting into their opponent's territory. Only problem is, they're not finishing off the drives with touchdowns. They're having to settle for field goals. That could eventually catch up to them. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Wisconsin is up by six. He's on the run, looking for the corner. He's at the 40. Brought down at the 30. First down. First and 10, ball on the 30. Makes the catch and look out. He's pushed out of bounds at the 13. First down. From the 13-yard line, it's first down. Nice run up the middle. Allen gains around six yards on the run. Wisconsin's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Makes the catch, and the defense is all over him. They bring him down for a loss. He's scrambling. They bring the quarterback down. They'll call on the field goal unit here. Wisconsin with a six-point lead. Kicks away, and the field goal is good. We've played a half. Wisconsin leads 9-0.
Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. Both teams wanted to establish a running game. Both teams were stubborn in trying to do so, and neither team was successful. Did you get the sense the defense knew what was coming? Hey, dude, first and 10 means run. Yeah, I think, I think when you do it every single time, it doesn't really uh, make it hard for a defense to figure out. You can become much more aggressive. you got to take some chances. I, you want to stick with the one. You want to have that balance. But if you don't push the ball down the field, then I never have to honor it. So mix in some first down passes and runs. Just about set to start the second half. What are you looking for? I I'm looking to see which team has that decided schematical advantage. And if they can find it, they'll blow holes three or four axe handles wide. Brad and Kirk will be there to call the second half. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. Whoa, he just took a licking. Wisconsin's continuing to play extremely tough defense. This has been impressive. It's just been impressive to watch them play with such an attitude, almost a chip on their shoulder with the energy that they're playing with. And I think it's going to require that kind of effort to be able to win this game. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He tackles him for a loss. Second and 15. Ball in the 23. Three down, three down. Check 82. Watch 82. Running. Run. 68. Run. 68. And he's taken down at the 25 yard line. Caught again in two yards. That brings us to 12. And he's going to be sacked. But the defense is fired up, responding and reacting to that sack. Not only do they get the quarterback, but they hit him and hit him hard. I think that can really create some confidence for this defense. The next time this quarterback drops back to throw, you got to be thinking he's going to be a little bit gun shy and concerned about the pressure that these defense is putting on him. Fourth and long here after the sack. He really got a hold of that one. And he's taken down at the 38-yard line. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Hands it to the back. They'll bring him down at about the 45. That's good for the game of 17 yards. That makes it first and 10. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 45. Mike 8! Mike 8! He's out of bounds around the 42-yard line. He's going to try and scramble. He's tackled at the 30 yard line. From the 30 yard line, first down. And they'll get him in the backfield. Got 
got his man. Can't tack on any yardage. Good for a gain of six yards. That'll bring up third and six. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 20. And it's caught. And down he goes, right around the 18-yard line. First down. And he's tackled at the 15. From the 15-yard line, second down. He scrambled. And he can't get away from the pressure. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush, because sacks can be real drive killers. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Throws complete and he stopped immediately. Fourth down. They're going to go for the easy three here. It's up, and he got it. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The defense really shut these guys down the last time they had the ball. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. Throws it in a hurry. She's taken down at the 26. We've got a second and nine here. Ball on their own 26. Quick throw, incomplete. One of his receiver. Sheffield was the intended receiver on the way. That'll make it 39. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. Tackle made at the 37. From their own 37-yard line, first down. The running back gets two on the carry. Second and eight. Ball on the 39-yard line. Gains his way to midfield. scrambling decides to tuck it in and he's got space you know that saying get your keys out because we're on a drive this offense right now is on a drive I mean this is their third first down they're doing just about anything they want and they're really starting to wear the psyche of this defense down we've got a first and ten ball on the 39 yard line He's knocked out of bounds at about the 35. And this play is number eight on the drive. Quick 
Quick throw out to the receiver. Tackle right around the 30. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. There's a little bit of happy feet down there on the field. Let's get the call. False start. Offense. They'll give this one another try after the flag. And on third down, too. That's when you don't want those kind of things to happen. He goes out of bounds around the 30-yard line. So close, but they fall short of the first down. You've got to throw the ball a little deeper next time. Don't take any chances of coming up short. And it's the offense that takes the field on fourth down. Let's go. Check, check. Oh. Gets out to around the 22. This is the 11th play of the current drive. Makes it to the 22-yard line. It's second and nine. Ball on the 22. it out left to the running back and they make the stop at the eight yard line 13th play of the drive coming up now he tries to buy some time and they bring him down for a sack on the play loss of one on the play that brings up second and goal And here's the 14th play of the drive. Scrambling around. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. Call a loss of three yards on the way. That makes it 30 goal. This is play number 15 of a very impressive drive. Zipped it out, and that was almost picked off. Well, the offense catches a break here. That ball should have been intercepted there by the safety, so the quarterback gets the ball back here for this next down. This isn't much more than an extra point. He gets it up, and they tack on three points. They line up to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Last drive resulted in a field goal, and the offense will come back out looking to do one better. He fights forward to about the 26. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 26. Brought down right around midfield. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 50. And 
he is drilled at the 44. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Makes it out to about the 46. From the 46-yard line, third down. They'll spread the field with five wide. Quick pass, and he's taken down at the 34-yard line. That's three down and one to go. Wisconsin's lead is nine. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Mike eight, Mike eight. Let's go, easy, easy, easy. Delta. Fires out to his receiver. They'll bring him down at the 25. That'll make it second and inches. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. Tackled after a decent pickup. And this is the eighth play of the drive. And he's met in the backfield. That makes it second, and ten. second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 19. Fires quickly to the tight end. Huge play, and it's going to be first and goal. Good pitch and catch there on second down. Yep, it was good enough to get him the first down. That's just a nice play. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Tackled for a loss. And he was pretty much stuffed on that run. You know what, that was just a nice job by the defense in stopping him before he could get going and build up momentum. Ball inside the 10-yard line. Second down. That's a live ball. It's recovered. This is the 12th play of this drive. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. Nothing going on that one. That's a nice completion, but give the defense a lot of credit. They weren't fooled at all. They were able to hold him to a short game. So it's fourth down. This should be an easy field goal. Kicks away, and it splits the uprights. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Burks from the two, and he makes it out to about the 21-yard line. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. Brad, you and I have seen some crazy things happen over the years. Anything can still happen. They've got to get a touchdown on this drive, and if they can, Hold on, look out. Maybe they got a shot to come back and get into the game. Now he's going to run and watch out. He's tackled right around the 28-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Ready. 
Runs outside for a nice game. He's on the run, and he's sacked. You can't take sacks like that as a quarterback. You just can't. If you can't find a receiver, get out of the pocket and throw the ball away. From their own 29-yard line, second down. He's to the 40. He's pushed out of bounds. Right around the 42-yard line. Throws quick to the receiver, and it falls incomplete. So it's fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. Again with the run, and they push him out at the 49. They hand it off, and they hit him in the backfield. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. Second and 11 coming up now. Ball on the 48. And down he goes at the 49-yard line. It's the ninth play of the drive. Got it. Touchdown, Purdue. receiver flew down the field on that touchdown connection. Well, he has the speed to stretch the defense, and his hands are getting better every single game. That's a great touchdown, Brad, but what happened to the coverage there by the defense? The defensive coordinator's got to be beside himself. You know, you work all week long on studying an offense and their tendencies, and then to have a mental error and to leave the star receiver open like that for a touchdown? Well, they've got to regroup. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 27. So the Badgers have been rolling on offense, and they look at the scoreboard, and it's still a tight ball game. I can't believe that this is still a close game. As you said, they, they have such a huge advantage, and yet it's a tight game. They've just blown too many opportunities. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. Throws complete. He's got room to work. And he's tackled at the 48. First down. First and 10, ball on the 48-yard line. Quickly to the tight end, incomplete. They get nice yardage on that run. 
They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. He fights forward to about the 39. Taken down around the 31 yard line. Terrific run in a crucial spot. The big key was the offensive line giving the ball carrier room to get upfield. It's first and 10. Ball on the 31 yard line. Less than three minutes in the game. Scrambled. Tackle made at the 17. The offensive coordinator has to be elated with the way his offense right now is executing. They're not in a hurry, but they're very, very methodical and very consistent with their approach. That's the third first down that they've picked up on this drive. Tackle at about the 17-yard line. And he didn't get much on that scramble before they drilled it. Brad, that's a great way for the quarterback to get himself injured. He needs to be a lot more careful out there. Allen gets a ball left side. The five. Big play there, and now they're looking at first and goal. Wisconsin, this is a big first and goal. Brad, that's a huge first down for this offense. At this point, the defense's only hope is they've got to try to rip that ball away from the quarterback or the running back to get the football back to their offense because the... Keeps it, and he's got a touchdown. Less than two minutes in the fourth quarter. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Wisconsin lines up for the kickoff. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Yeah, they're dialing up some good blitzes, disguising them very well. This aggressive defense has enjoyed multiple sacks tonight. The guys lining up on defense have really contributed to this two-possession lead. This offense did really well with the air attack on their last trip out there. Let's see if they can do the same thing here. Well, I think this defense has got to do something because right now the quarterback is in such a good rhythm that you've got to do something to try to get him out of it. I would suggest trying to bring more pressure. Try to come up with an exotic blitz look to try to get him on his heels as opposed to being the aggressor and attacking the defense. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. That's what can happen when you run the same play. Yeah, you need to be aware of that and try to mix things up to keep the defense off balance. release. Oh, had it knocked down. It's fourth down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Wow, you just gotta 
love it for this defense. They come up with the stop of the ball game and maybe the season. And the defense comes through. Well, they had a lot of success on their last possession, and now they're going to start this one off with excellent field position. It's hard to ask your defense to come out and make a stop when they're already backed up this far within their own end zone. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. That makes it second and six. From the 28-yard line, second down. We have less than a minute to go. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Bring him down at the 20-yard line. Call it a game three yards. First down. Tight, tight. And the ball game's over. And our final score in this one, Wisconsin 22, Purdue 10. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreet, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.